Okay. And we're back. Uh, I had a knock at the door. I had to go take care of that. And I'm back on it now. I forgot what I was doing. So I'm just going to run headlong into this and try and get back into it. Okay, now I remember what I was doing. I was yelling at my TV screen for several minutes. Excuse me. Look out. Coming through. Don't mind me. Oh, hi. Hello. Bang, bang. Perfect. 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 Okay, now this part's tricky. Ah! That was scarier than anything in any of the recent Silent Hill games. Oh, yeah. Come here. Come here. Yeah. Yeah. It's the small things in life. It really is. Ha! Yes! 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 Let's see, is there anything I can grab in here? There's this thing. This thing's nice. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Yes! Perfect. Perfect. Oh, fucking hate you. Ah. Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay. I'm good now. Alright, let's just uh let's just cheese this a little bit, shall we? Okay, bye. Done and done. First try, completely flawless. Nobody saw it. <laughs> uh grab this. So where am I supposed to where else am I supposed to go here? Okay. Whoops! Oh no. Oh no. I remember this part. I'll take that, thank you. I remember this part. This part's rough. There really is no good way to just run through and take care of everyone. You have to play it smart with this one. Smart. Uh oh. Uh oh. Who's patrolling? Who's patrolling? You're patrolling? Who's out? Who's out? Who's out? Oh man, that fucking door noise. Aha! Aha! You're on patrol? You're not anymore. Fuck! First of all, give me your knife. I want it. Best weapon in the game. Best weapon in the game! Alright. Fuck! Oh shit! Well, I'll take your knife anyways. Come here. Come here. Yes, that's right. That's right. Come into the room, please. Thank you. Perfect. Absolutely flawless. Ah, you have to play. Ooh, two dogs at once! I'm gonna pet the dogs! I pet the dogs. They're very happy. Can you see their tail wagging? Their tails, I should say. Right now we're on top of it. Now we're in it. Now we're getting it. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Save me, knife. Who else? Who else? Who else? Uh. Alright, alright, alright. Yeah, yeah. Come here, come here. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, I know you want it. Yes. He was acting all coy, pretending like he didn't. But I knew he was one. Wanting this. Oh man, it's just, it's falling. Oh, oh! Fucking shit! Alright, let's just do this all over again. Please come into the room now. Thank you. Perfect. Absolutely flawless. Alright, let's see here. You? Okay. What a cute dog. I'm gonna pet it. I pet it a little too hard. I know there's more. Around here somewhere. I know there is. Quit lying to me. Oh! I found him. Okay, whatever. I don't even care anymore. Fuck. Don't worry. 
I have the perfect strategy. I'm gonna stay right here and just keep doing this. No, get, get back here, you prick. Fuck you. Fine, I didn't want to kill you anyways, but Baka. Oh my god, I can't believe I just made that fucking joke. I hate myself. Well, I deserve that. I deserve that for that joke alone. <sighs> Give me your knife, and now we wait. The fuck ever. The fuck you say, game. The game's all like, no, he's alive though, and I'm like, fuck you. I disagree. It. I think I won that argument, game. Who's alive now, bitch? He's not. He had a wife and kids. I'm a monster. He was almost done paying off his mortgage. I should feel ashamed of myself. And yet, I'm not. Oh my god, dude. Ah, oh, fuck off! See, there are times when you just see yourself making the decision and knowing that it's really bad. And yet you continue to act. As though somehow things will be different. When in all actuality, they will never be different. Things will never get any better. And to hope that they will, by doing the same thing over and over again, is madness. Pure and simple. Wow, that's really cool how it locked onto that guy over there when the guy here was closer. What a good lock-on system. Again, lock onto the other guy. Thank you. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. All right. Ah, shit. This area is so rough. They all have windows where you can see, where they can see you commit, committing your precious murders. Look at this guy. He doesn't have any weapons. What's he gonna do? Wow. The dog was having a little trouble there. strategy. Oh my god, he's so confused. He doesn't know what to do without a weapon. Ah, now he knows what to do. He knows how to die. He died real good. Oh, fucking come on! There was that one last guy. so good, you guys. Look at all the... It's a thinking man's game, you know? You just, you have to strategize properly. Think about your actions before you commit them. Okay. Now I know there's one more guy walking around here that has a shotgun. And I... Aha! There he is. And he's pretty much only there to kill me when I get impatient. Oh, come on. Aw, oh, come on! I hate this game. Oh, fuck! Phew. I'll take that, thank you. Actually, no. Okay, alright. Okay, now we're done. Fucking finally, holy shit. Just get the fuck out of here. Oh, oh, oh. 
at one level it took me like 20 minutes. And I don't even get a good score for my trouble. Oh no, my friend. Hey look, it's that guy again. Have we met before? No, you, I don't know what you're talking about. I've never seen you before in my life. Wonder, because I I remember one time I like touched the hood of the car and it started. Wonder if I can do get that to happen again. No, okay. <laughs> Starting your car by touching the hood—that would be ridiculous. Don't be silly. Oh, who the fuck are you and why are you in my house? Oh, hello there. By the way, guys, this game is very violent, just in case you need to know. I can't read that. I want to read it, whatever it is. Honey, uh, your friend, I, you know, just, just let me know when you want to have friends over. Because, uh, you know, just let me know for the future, you know, just in case, I don't know. Look at him go. <laughs> I need that report. Don't worry. Oh. Oh. Hi. So yeah, this is kind of a thing about the, the narrative is eventually, like, Jacket starts seeing things that probably aren't there. And there was that story bit that I accidentally skipped earlier, where a character in the game literally explains that it's not happening. Oh no. Oh uh, no no no. I remember this level and I need guns, unfortunately. Fuck. Perfect. Perfect. Does this have any guns left? No, it does not. Anyways, I need guns, so I went ahead and picked Peter. I exchanged my fast walking pace. Oh my god, I'm so slow in exchange for guns that are automatically quieter. And as you can see, it's paying off a lot. Wow, that's nice. Come here. Dang it! I love how I killed his friend behind him somehow, but not him! Fuck! Fuck! Damn it! Fuck you! I just had one more bullet. Got my wish. Sweet. Okay. Good guards they have employed here. He fucking took a bullet to the shoulder and kept on walking. See, that's just really poor observational skills, but at the same time, it means he's a fucking champ. Again! It happened again! <laughs> oh, fuck. really good that this game has an auto lock because I'm terrible at actually aiming. Please lock on to this guy, thank you.
No! Fuck. something to say there. Wow. Again. would be so kind as to get back over to a little to the left, please. Ah, oh, fuck. Alright. I just gotta be smart about this, you know. Ah, I like not doing that, for example. Now, if you could... You too. Mm. All right. Ah, the door. sticking through the arm through the wall yes his arm was sticking through his arm that's exactly how violently I messed him up 
Hey, are you ready for a boss encounter? Because I know I am. Not. Never mind. Well, okay then. Okay, alright. Oh. Yes, I did it. Perfect. I give up. You win. Okay, cool. I'm gonna walk away. Except I'm not allowed to walk away. I have to go over and kill him. So. That was a little fucked up. I couldn't have just, you know, shot him. Couldn't have just bludgeoned him. No. He had to bash his face in. Break all of his fingers individually and his joints. And then light him on fire. So this game's a little fucked up. Oh, by the way, this game's a little fucked up. And let's see here. Hey, you. VIPs only. Fuck you, I'm very important. Hi there, you don't look so good. I'm looking at you, motherfucker. What are you gonna do about it? You gonna sit there and gurgle? That's what I thought. Yeah, fuck you. I don't need this place. Fucking undead. Coming around, taking our jobs. Part four. Connections. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Wow, that's really weird. Close the door. This music is so ominous, you guys. Look at him. So, I kn he's wearing a mask, too. I know you can get his mask, I just don't know how. And when you start with his mask, you get that sweet fucking weapon he's got right there. It's a silent submachine gun. Oh, that's shitty. That's really shitty. And of course, his mask is a fucking rat, right? Of course it is. Let's get this over with. Alright. <laughs> Press X to restart, I guess. Whoa. And look, you can you can see all your dead self. See all of it. You and me now. I'm sure, you know by now that's won't end well. Soon we'll be all alone, but that's okay. Before you say goodbye, I'll let you in on a secret. What you do from here on won't serve any purpose. You will never see the whole picture, and it's all your own fault. Now it's time for you to leave. There's a warm bed across the hall. Looks like you need some rest. Yeah, I'm feeling really tired. I mean, I got shot today, and I bled out on the floor for a few hours. That's really exhausting. I'm, I'm feeling pretty sleepy. This bed looks comfortable. Oh, I'm already in it. Well, never mind, I guess. Yeah. <sighs> so yeah, this is where the plot kind of takes a turn. She has pink eyes. That's so weird. It's a really weird thing to point out, actually, too, because it's kind of innocuous. Yeah, and I, I, you may have missed it because I was skipping through the dialogue, because whatever. Oh, man. And remember what I said before, when you move the screen tilts a little bit? Now it's extreme. Now, like, walking at all, the screen, the screen is just going nuts. And then there's this. You walk too much and you start losing control, and then you get a headache. So. Mm. Yeah, this is safe. Super safe. It's the safest thing you could do. Oh my god, I hate. Ugh. This, is, this level right here is where the pacing just takes a massive dive. Alright. Alright, I gotta time it to where he's reading. Aw, oh, fuck you! Fuck you, you were reading something. You can't say that. And, and they knew, 
They knew people hate this part, because instead of starting there, back where my bed was, I'm already in this room here. Okay, timed it perfect. Except you gotta be careful, there's a window there, the doctor could see me. Oh. This is one of the roughest parts in the game. Alright, let me see here now. Uh, you need to get that to get down the elevator. <sighs> but look at all this shit you have to deal with. And you can't deal with it normally. This is one of those get through the fucking door. God damn it. A lot of people hate this part, really, because it, the pacing just takes a huge dive. But I'm okay with it. Like, oh, fuck off! I, I appreciate that it, it completely breaks the game's own conventions that it sets up that you have to play by. Like, I, I get why that can be frustrating. I don't personally like when games do that. But at the same time, this game's kind of a one-trick pony when it comes to those very conventions. So, I actually kind of like them mixing it up a little bit. And go. Ah, get in the, get in the, get in the fucking door! God damn it! Oh wait, is that door locked? Well, no, it shouldn't be. It didn't look like it was locked. There's usually at least some kind of indication that the doors are locked. Hmm. Ah, oh, fuck you. I was around a corner. Excuse me. Yeah, this part's really fucking rough because the cops are just so good, and if you get spotted at all, just instantly go back. And then you also have to contend with this, if you go, if you do too much walking, the screen goes all blurry, and then your character just stops walking, it's really fucking rough. Get through the door. The door is locked! It won't open! Fuck! Then where do I go? Oh my god. I can't get in there either. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. <sighs> but yeah, I mean, like, the game can be frustrating normally anyways, but it's fun. Like, this section, it's not very fun. In fact, when I'm just playing by myself, I typically just skip it. Fuck! I trying to get to the fucking door. All right. Yes, got it. Okay, perfect. And now we gotta wait for the fucking screen to settle back down. Go. Sometimes it's actually better just walk into a corner to make his headache happen so it'll just be fucking done with. Ugh. Alright, and go. Get. There we go. Perfect. Fuck you. Here's the dirty trick of this level is it's so huge that you can't really see both these patrolling dudes at any one point. So you have to be extra careful. And you have to wait extra long in one spot. Yay! It's so, so fun. I mean, it's not really a fun section, but it's not really supposed to be. Get in the doorway, thank you. Oh, jeez, I'm going nuts here. 
Oh. Where's the other one? There you are. Also, I love that the patrolling persons, they look kind of like dudes, but then they have the lady face. Book cover. Oh, come on! Fuck you! That is shit. It's absolute shit. I love that there's a door right there. Realistically, I'm on the ground floor. This should be like where the other exit is, and I should just be able to go through there, but I can't. Alright. So much fun. So much fun, you guys. Look how much fun I'm having. It's, it's the funnest. <sighs> can you see me? Yes, you can. Good. I'm so glad you could see me. That wasn't frustrating at all. Oh, whatever! Come on! I, I have to say, that is the one... Those are the ones that I feel the most robbed on. When I'm clearly fucking behind them, but they're literally just about to start up the turning animation, so they just flip around and spot you. That's the worst. That feels the worst. And plus, they seem to have, like, a 180-degree, like, um, vision cone, which is really aggravating. Because most of the regular enemies in the game don't have that, it seems. But these do- WHAT?! Oh, Uh-oh. Uh Are you gonna spot me? No, you're not. So it seems like the side-to-side -side vision cone seems to be less strong. wait for you to go by and then just make book it for the door. Shit, shit, shit. Don't do that. Don't do that, please. Really need you to not do that. Almost, almost, almost. Oh, we can just get... Yes! Oh, finally. But hey, remember, that didn't serve any purpose. And I love this, too. It looks kind of like he's blinking. So it's like... Yeah, just walk all the way home. Let's just tear up the police tape. I'm sure that won't be suspicious to anybody. And just... And did you notice, too? As soon as I put on this dirty old jacket, my head's just fine now. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Yeah, and then just go right back to it. Alright. Glad that's over with, and let's get back to- oh no. So that's the other thing, is like, hey, remember when you were doing Russian Mafia dudes? And you could at least justify it with, well, they deserve it because they're doing bad things. Well, now you're taking on a cop station. So it's like, there really isn't any more justification for what you're doing. Because it's purely out of... Oh, how did you not see that? I'm so glad this is what my tax dollars are paying for. Yeah, just get that fucking joke in there, right? Come on. Oh, you saw that? Well, now you don't see anything. Okay, if I can... If I can... Ah! Excuse me. Haha, <laughs> don't worry about it. Oh, come on with that. Also, I love that, like, um... It's again, one of those times where you just, you, you're in the middle of making a poor decision, and you know it's a poor decision, but you're making it anyways. 
Alright. Alright. Come on, 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 come on. Alright, fine. Mm. Love that pixely blood spray. It's so good. <laughs> hey guys, don't you have security cameras? Like, yeah, there's one right there. Fuck, 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 fuck. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry about it. It's fine. It's fine. See how fine it is? If I could just get through the door. That is the true enemy of this game. Doors. Oh, yes! Oh. Okay. Okay. Just you left. <coughs> yes! I don't like these billy clubs. They're not as fast as I like. But that's not important right now. Oh, you don't have an all your shells? Fine, I'll just pick this up. But by the way, this is another um, mechanic they introduced. If you walk through these with metal, the alarms will go off and everyone will come at you. Um, okay, here we go. Now we're talking. Because I, I wanted a shotgun, but I actually wanted to have all six rounds. Oh, this next part's rough! Whoa, you're not supposed to do that yet. Oh, shit. Oh, this part's rough. Whoa. Yes, yes. Perfect. Uh, what? How did that not kill you? Fuck off. I really should have just grabbed a melee weapon so I could, like, hide around the corner. Oh, That's right. Come pick up the shotgun. Pick up the shotgun. Mm. Yeah? Keep quiet. Don't say anything. That's right. Walk in place like a good boy. Look at him. Look at him. I'm making him dance. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, so close to actually surviving that. Fuck you. No, 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 no. Grat, what the fuck? Okay, this seems to be the best right here. Okay, so it's not the best then. Come on, come on. Yes, 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 yes. Sorry. That. What? Why did that take two shots? Fuck off. Alright, come here. Yeah? Get him. No! Come here, come here, come here. Oh, not that fast, please. Whoa, he was freaking out. Get him, get him, get him! Fuck off! Come on. Come on. <clears throat> Alright, let's just drop this in here for myself. No, in here. Okay, that's good. Fuck! Like, in my mind, I saw the door there, and I was like, well, he can't get me because there's a door in the way. Little did I know, the door was already open. Whatever! Oh, okay. Lock onto this guy, please. Thank you. I'll just drop this in here. Bang. Oh, 
Oh, nice. All right. Okay. All right. <laughs> you didn't hear that? You're a terrible police officer. How many left? No! Oh, I was actually on a roll for once. Fucking hell. Fuck. God dang it. Come here. Come here. No, come back over here, please. Over here. Over here. Over here. Over here, you stupid prick. Okay. Shotgun in the corner. And let's go. every conceivable way. All I had to do was cheese the game. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Surprise! Surprise! Uh-oh. Who's left? You are? Okay. Now you're not. <laughs> oh, goodness. Thank goodness for this auto lock, though. Holy shit. If it weren't for that, I would not even be able to do any of, any of this at all. Ah, there we go. Surprise. Script, give me your... Give me the billy club, please. Thank you. That'll have to do. Wait, 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 wait. I forgot about you. Where's the, where's the, the shotgun here? Yes, the shotgun will open that door for me. And then I can just do this little number. And I can just cheese the fucking game like a punk. Just, just play cheap, kids. Just play it lame. Oh, okay. Play it lame, kids. I'll take that, thank you. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Yes, 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 yes! Oh, look. It's his uh, weapon. In evidence. Baseball bat. All right, that was frustrating, and now I'm gonna come around here and take it out on you, bitch. Come here. Oh yeah. Hey, remember me? Actually, let me just actually face you. Sorry about anything personal, but. Uh, da -da -da -da. No answers. I'm not here for answers. I'm here to beat your fucking face in, bitch. I bet it did. In fact, I hope it did. It might be not that different. Yeah, we both have the animal masks and go kill people for money. Yeah, I have been getting those phone calls. Don't blah blah blah. Police might know more something about more about this whole mess. I have a file somewhere. I'd ask you to spare my life, but yeah, I think we both know that's not gonna happen. Honestly, that was a little bit flaccid. Uh, and I, I've done this before. I know you can't really do any other execution moves on it. Which is kind of a shame. And now, the music's done. And so am I. I think this would be a good place to cut off right about here, so...
Vroom, vroom. But yeah, the hospital level is really weird. It's super frustrating compared to the rest of the game. Actually, which is really says something because it's a game where you constantly fucking die and start over again. <laughs> Excuse me. Yeah, e even for a game of that convention, it's, it's even more frustrating. And, and like I said, it kind of like it gets rid of the game's own conventions that it sets up for you to play by. Like, here's your rules, play by them. Oh, but let's change the rules now. And, and it feels a little weird. But then again, the boss encounters do that too. Like, you'll notice the boss encounters kind of change the rules a little bit. Like, the biker dude could take two hits to kill him instead of one, like most enemies in the game. Or, in order to defeat the guy in the van, you had to kill all his cronies while he tossed firebombs at you. And stuff like that, it, it just it changes the, the way you play the game. And it feels a little raw sometimes that you still die in a single, like, touch. But at the same time, if they didn't do it that way, I would say that the bosses, the boss encounters just wouldn't be as interesting. If you could kill the biker dude in a single hit, that fight would feel fucking flaccid, to be honest with you. But hey, that's just me. Anyways, I'm gonna call it here. Uh, I hope you had as much fun as I did. Goodbye.